Anna. I'm an industry relations manager here at CLIA, and I'm going to just quickly go through some housekeeping before introducing our presenter. This webinar will run about 40 minutes with time for questions at the end. Please feel free to type your questions into the questions module of the webinar, and we'll get to them at the conclusion of the presentation. This webinar is being recorded and will be posted on CLIA's YouTube channel, which is CLIA Global. And with that, it is my pleasure to introduce our presenter, Charlie Metz. Charlie is the Regional Sales Director for Scenic Luxury Cruises with over 20 years experience working with retail travel advisors. He manages the East Coast and has traveled extensively throughout the world, including several cruises on both Scenic and Emerald. During the recent East Coast cruise of the Eclipse, he conducted tours on the world's first discovery yacht for over 100 agents in five cities. And the last thing I'll mention is that Charlie has generously provided everyone with several scenic social media banners and other collateral, which you can find in the handouts portion of the webinar pane. And with that, take it away, Charlie. Well, hello, everybody. Um, I hope you are all safe and well during these times. That's me on the left. Tried to personalize this a little bit. That's me in my home office in Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. And I'm, I guess most of us are working at home these days. So. We at Scenic are thrilled to be presenting today. And on the right-hand side of this slide, I have what we will cover. We'll, we will concentrate on what is new for 2021 and 22. We'll cover Scenic Cruises, both the river and the ocean, including the Scenic Eclipse. We'll cover Emerald Cruises, including the river cruising and ocean cruising with the new Emerald Azura. Talk a little bit about groups and charters cover agent incentives and rewards, uh, finish up with current offers. And then at the end, we'll give you a current status on what's happening at Scenic right now through the balance of the year and have a, a Q&A session. So let's start. Here's our happy owners. This is Glenn Maroney and his wife, Karen. They're very innovative folks. Uh, as you can see here are the logos of all of our brands. So we're one team. We have an office in the USA in Boston. We have an office in the UK, Australia, Malta, and Canada. So we are kind of a worldwide company. Glenn is a very innovative guy and a visionary. He is not real well known in the industry. He's not the face of the industry. He likes to stay behind the scenes. His passion really is shipbuilding. He owns a shipyard in Croatia, uh, shipbuilding, ship design, and uh, decorating the ship. So they make a real good team. So why the scenic brands? First of all, let's just talk about innovation, inclusion, and our river cruise cover. You know, owner Glenn Maroney, back in 2008, he opened a new and historic chapter when he commenced, uh, commenced scenic, and we took on an exciting world of shipbuilding. Our first exclusive, all-inclusive scenic spaceships were launched on European waterways and more akin to like floating hotels. It wasn't long before guests were flocking to experience private balconies, world-class dining, and of course, butler service. Then we started Emerald Waterways and the innovation uh, again showcased through the beautiful retractable roof swimming heated pool on every Emerald Waterways that clients loved spending time sitting by the pool during the day and enjoying a movie at night. Show you more on that later. Then in 2016, we launched the South uh, East Asia River Cruising uh, which provided one more time scenic leading rivers in this region with beautiful uh, scenic spirit and aurora and last year with the Emerald Harmony. So on the ocean front, our innovation aspects get into the launch of the scenic eclipse with two helicopters, a submarine and 10 gourmet restaurants. And we'll tell you more about that at the end. And then next year we will launch the Emerald Azura. So on the inclusion side, uh, we really have a cruise for every type of uh, traveler. Are you looking for the best valued cruise for your clients? Look at Emerald Waterways, which is the best kept secret in the industry. If you're looking for a truly all-inclusive luxury experience, check out Scenic. You know, our guests are true travelers at heart, and we understand the guest needs for exploring, discovering the world, and make sure that these options are available for our guests on board. From our Scenic Free Choice, to Scenic and Rich on Scenic Rivers, to the fantastic Scenic Discovery Team on the Scenic Eclipse. And then on Emerald Cruises, we have Activity Managers, Emerald Plus and Emerald Active. The last thing I'll just cover on why Scenic Brands are our, our River Cruise Cover. 
It's the first and only of its kind. Uh, scenic and Emerald River Cru Cruise guests are automatically covered once the cruise begins. There's no extra charge that's included in your pricing. It's designed to ensure for un unforeseen events rather than minor delays or deviations. Our guests are covered for any delays or cancellations that occur during high, low water, weather, natural disasters, mechanical breakdowns or strikes. And claims are paid in cash in the original form of payment. Um, and they're just not valid for our Russia cruises. This next page, our commitment to you, we want to reassure you that all the scenic global brand management team is working closely with CLIA and various government health agencies to implement full range of measures for health and safety for our valued guests, crew, while on board and while on shore. So in preparation for the resumption of our river cruise operations, we will ensure compliance with the strict industry protocols and provide further information as these policies are finalized. Here's some of the bullet points for you to review. One of the things that's not up here that I learned this week when, when Glenn gave a little briefing was our suites have their own air circulation units. I found that to be very interesting. I think customers may ask about that. So let's get into Scenic River Cruising. This is the uh, Scenic Cristal, uh, just a view of one of our ships. Uh, the Scenic True All-Inclusive Experience. We call our ships the River Ships Spaceships. There are all suites on board. There are butler service for every guest on board. Unlimited dining and beverages, including top shelf liquors. We have uh, a program called the Scenic Enrich program where we take you behind the scenes and uh, you, giving you the opportunity to experience some very unique um, experiences. We have free choice where your customers can pick and choose the tours they want in each of the cities. We have an app, a, an app on, that goes on your phone, which is great. I still have it on my phone for my cruises. It's tailor-made. And one day my wife and I did not take the optional tours. We just walked around town on our own and we used the app, which was fantastic. And then I'll finish up by talking about the nth degree. I'd be remiss if we didn't show you some of the awards for uh, Scenic River Cruising. Uh, we get the Cruise Choice Critic, Cruise Critic Awards. Uh, for best river cruise ship, best cruise line for enrichment, top 10 river cruise lines, and best river cruise line shore excursions. We're very proud of our shore excursions, the Enrich program, and the free choice because we started out as a tour company. Where do we cruise? So as you can see here, this is the uh, scenic river cruise. The main area is the Rhine and the Danube. So we go from all the way from Amsterdam through the lower Danube. Our number one selling cruise, which I have been on, is called the Gems of the Danube. It starts in Nuremberg that you see in the middle here and uh, goes to Budapest. That is an eight day, seven night voyage right through the beautiful Pastile Valley. So that's our number one selling cruise. We also have France. We also do the Bordeaux region. We have uh, Portugal. Uh, we also do uh, the Seine and the Rhone, and we have Russian cruises. So this is where Scenic sails. Okay, highlights. What is new for 2021? You may want to take a little pen out for this one. Uh, we've got, uh, in France, we've got two new itineraries in France. Tastes of Southern France and Flavors of Bordeaux. Both are 11-day cruises. So you learn the art of barrel making, uh, visit an organic goat cheese farm, have onboard dinner with a Michelin star chef, um, explore a local mustard producer. Um, we have half hour uh, access to the site du chocolate and lunch at a beautiful restaurant in Lyon. So um, we're doing, we also added for new for 2021, is in the Rhine, the Danube, the gens of the Danube from Nuremberg to Budapest, we added uh, the artisan castle dating back to the 13th century. Um, and it's a beautiful site and tour. You can see this family crypt, uh, the on-site museum, and here age-old tales directly from the current owners of the castle. So that's an added tour. On the Romantic Rhine and Moselle, uh, we'll visit the town of uh, Eucrates and 
uh, I can't say this past the town, historic and sacred World War I battle sites. Uh, visited Gutenberg Museum, founded in 1900, one of the oldest museums showcasing printing from around the world. And then in Portugal, we've added uh, the ancestry of kitchen. We'll visit a local home for authentic and secret bread making experience. Uh, we'll visit the Provençal village, which is a scenic and rich program. Take the walking tour of the local church, short piano recital, um, and other activities. Okay, scenic. Here is one of our river ships. So just to kind of show you the basic layout. Uh, in the front, we have Portobello's restaurant. We've got a panorama deck. We've got the River Cafe here in the front. Uh, everybody gets the complimentary Taylor Wi-Fi we talked about. This is the, ca uh, the, the bridge. We've got the panorama lounge and bar, um, the crystal dining area, a wellness area, and then all the cabins are back here. Uh, the Royal Owner Suites are in the mid deck. Uh, the three decks are the diamond deck is the top deck, the sapphire in the middle, and the jewel is the lower. We've got Royal Panorama Suites in the back, and then you see the sun deck and terrace on the top. I'm just going to fly through a few of these just to give you a little uh, uh, perception of what the ship looks like. Uh, the ships look like. This is the scenic reception area. Uh, we have dining and beverages. We have uh, a venue, a menu to suit every occasion. Uh, we include the River Cafe. Portobello's, La Amour, Table of Riv. Uh, we've got in-suite service. All food and beverages are included in your package. Wellness area. This is our salt room, which is kind of exclusive to Scenic uh, um, Cruise Lines. We've added these last year. We have a wellness center. We have a fitness center on board. And then the service on board is impeccable. We have butler service for all guests. On the cruise I went on, I used the butler service three times. I had my uh, sport coach dry cleaned. Um, we had uh, breakfast and coffee one morning in our suite. And I got a hamburger on Thursday night because I was just uh, hungry for a little something different from the gourmet food. Laundry service is included twice a week and you can have your laundry done uh, anytime. This is our lowest cabin. It's on the uh, jewel deck. It's called, this. it's a standard suite. As you can see here, there is no balcony or um, sun lounge. The majority of the cabins on board Scenic are these balcony suites. As you can see where the carpet meets the right here, there is a glass door that goes across that you can shut at night if you want to have a little quiet if the ship is moving, but there's a full size sun lounge here. And then there's this exclusive button. You push a button and this window will go up and down. So it gives you the balcony, the sun lounge right in your room. It makes your room, your suite bigger. We also have two Royal Suites on board, the scenic right in the middle of the ship on the diamond deck. Uh, they're full-size suites with full-size bathrooms. And on three of the ships, the Opal, Jasper, and the Amber, we have Vitality Pools on the sun lounge on the top deck. Okay, the Scenic and Rich program. This is one of the things I love. On the cruise I went on the Gems of the Danube on Thursday night, we went to this private concert only for Scenic and Emerald guests at the Palace Liechtenstein. It was a one hour champagne reception and they put on a concert and a show. And it was a very beautiful event. It's just a one of the little tastes of what we do for the Scenic and Rich program. The Scenic Free Choice program means you have the opportunity to pick and choose tours in the city you're in every day. The seat, we have 30 scenic e-bikes on board. I went on a um, bike trip from Melk to Dernstein through the Passau Valley, it's about 30 kilometers. We went through three villages and five vineyards. And, and if, for those of you who have not been on an e-bike, even for your older guests, they're excellent. They have eight speeds, you have to pedal them but you can set the speed. So you pedal and if you drop below that speed, the bike automatically picks up and goes. So it makes it very easy for our guests to be able to do really something unique like a bike tour. Oops, went the wrong way, sorry about that. I talked about the Scenic TaylorMade app. This is fantastic to use. It tells you where you gotta be, where you wanna be, and uh, gives you verbal tours of all the cities that you'll be visiting. Uh, the Scenic Culinaire Program. And then we also partner with National Geographic uh, at Scenic Luxury Cruise Lines. 
So we have um, their uh, tour guides on board, photographers, guest lecturers. Um, so it's a very, very nice product that sells very well for us. Okay, I'm gonna jump over to the scenic Southeast Asia river cruising. So you can see here our cruise stops on the Irrawaddy on the left-hand side and the Mekong, Vietnam and Cambodia on the right-hand side. We've got some incredible ships. This is a, cop, uh, a picture of the Scenic Spirit. Um, the Scenic Spirit holds 68 guests. And once again, it's totally all-inclusive. Um, Five-star ships with the Scenic Suites, everything I talked about earlier. These ships have the one-to-one -one staff to guest ratio, the largest suites available in this part of the world. We have a, a, a much smaller ship than what you're used to on the Scenic River. This only holds 68 guests on the Mekong and 44 guests on the Scenic Aurora and the Irrawaddy. All suites have balconies, sun lounges, walk-in wardrobe, and authentic Asian styles. The dining is in Tapiaki Bar, and there's four dining options on board. Uh, we have Scenic and Rich activities, which include the exclusive Angler Temple Gala Dinner, uh, which is fantastic. I do have a video I normally show in this presentation, but we don't have time for that today. And then the nth degree, we offer European standards. We have local operations team based in the region to take care of your guests. We have offices in the area, in uh, Ho Chi Minh City, Phan Phen, uh, Mandalay area. We're environmentally friendly. We don't use plastic bottles on board. Guests are provided uh, a scenic water bottle that we collect and, and recycle. We have self-service laundry, but we have laundry service on board. Um, we have small group tours. We max 25 on the tours. And um, the scenic special stays, we have a hotel, remarkable for the locations uh, that we can add on to these. Okay. Oops. It's going to jump ahead. So just to show you some of the suites here, um, this is the scenic suites with, I'm sorry, I jumped, I pushed the button too fast here. So just bear with me one second. I'm sorry. This is slow to catch up. I just wanted you to see the spaces and people on board. Here's the scenic spirit lounge, crystal dining area, just a picture of our crew, and of course the pool on board. Now I'm gonna jump into, and then this is our, our suite lounges, which I jumped over just to give you a quick little glance at those. Okay, I'm gonna jump into the Scenic Eclipse, which is the world's first discovery yacht. I've had the opportunity to tra take travel agents on board. It's a 500 foot yacht. It only holds 200 guests, 200 crew. It's very, very unique. It's got 10 gourmet restaurants. It's got a beautiful spa on board, Census Spa. It's very unique because it has two helicopters and a submarine on board for the guests. I do have a video I will show you on this. We have Zodiacs. I just wanted you to see this picture. Kayaks, it's a polar rated class ship. So what does that mean? And safety is the highest priority with the scenic eclipse because it's built to the highest international safety and environmental standards, uh, ensuring we leave as small a footprint as possible when we're traveling to some of the world's beautiful, most beautiful areas. It's a Polar Class 6 rating, which is the highest of any luxury vehicle. It's got forward bow thrusters, an electronic zipoid propulsion system, um, and the Scenic Eclipse is, is able to safely negotiate the polar waters. Uh, we use custom-built stabilizers, as you can see here, that are 50% larger, and the, the ship does not have to be moving for the stabilizers to work. As you can imagine, if you're launching helicopters and submarines, you need to have a stable ship. Our uh, GPS dynamic positioning system is we don't drop anchor, which preserves some of the world's most um, beautiful sites. You know, we don't destroy in the environment by dropping an anchor. We just the ship will keep itself in position. The crew meet the team. So as I said, there's 200 crew on board. So on board here, you're looking at chefs, um, the captain and his crew. In the back there in the V area is the discovery team. Um, they do lectures and, and tell everybody and put together the daily optional tours for that of the things that you will see on board the Eclipse. 
and they're standing on the flight deck of the helicopter. Dining, 10 dining experiences throughout. Uh, we've got an unbelievable uh, wine bar, whiskey bar. There's a hundred different whiskeys here. Very unique. This is in the main area. The reception area is a big area. This is where a lot of people socialize, um, entertainment. Um, each one of these bottles is very unique. That's a metal rack with a with a magnet on the bottom of the whiskey bottles. So as it's going through the ocean, um, the whiskeys do not fall off. And there's over a hundred different whiskeys. And uh, several travel agents tested me when I was doing my tours, and we every time we had what they requested. Soar above helicopters. Every day they give you a little bit of a menu for you to um, um, see the um what you can what you can buy and what you can tour with these helicopters they're brand new we have two pilots on board we also have a daily submarine activity in each area so the submarine each of these hold seven passengers including the pilot i'm just going to flip through a couple of the rooms here before i just show you a short video on this um, this is our lead-in suite, which is 420 square feet. It's a deluxe veranda suite on board. The next suite and next two slides are the spa suite, which are 560 square feet. And as you well imagine, it has a spa suite uh, bath. This is one of my favorite suites, the panorama suites. They're 1,100 to 1,200 uh, square feet. And then we finish up with the owner's penthouse suite. Are you ready for this, folks? This is 2,100 square feet plus a, uh, this is the bathroom, beautiful bathroom in the suite. And then they have a, a veranda outside, which is another 650 square feet for just the owner's suite. So let me show you the video at this point. And... Let's see if this works. Scenic Eclipse, the world's first discovery yacht. Book now for 2020 to 22. Early bird offers out now. Okay, I'm going to try to figure out how to get back here to my screen. There we go. So this is the owner's uh, veranda pen uh, that I showed you before. Okay, let's hope it moves my slide. This show is kind of locked here. There we go. Um, you saw this in the video, the Yoga and Pilates studio for all guests. This is a very important area. This is the theater area and back that, um, uh, the whiskey bar I showed you, it's right on the other side. This seats about 120 people. The Discovery team does lectures in here every night. Look at these seats, very, very comfortable. And of course, we showed you this in the, in the video, this is Discovery Center. 
where you can come and change for your daily activity. Some of the excursions and activities that we offer. So our fleet of exploratory uh, zodiacs, kayaks, e-bikes, they'll take you exploring and have a range of active guided excursions for you. Um, on here. Okay, where does the eclipse travel to? Basically, it does a big loop around the world. Um, so basically, it spends uh, time in the Arctic, and I will show you some of the itineraries here in a second. But just to show you, all this ship does is just does a big loop around the world, and uh, it offers some very unique ports of call. It's the best new cruise ship and itineraries in the world. It's on the 2020 hot list. So some of the new voyages are the Franz Joseph Adventure, uh, the Lofton Island Norwegian Fjords, and the coastline of the, and now I'm going to switch over to uh, leave the eclipse, the scenic eclipse, and sh switch over to Emerald Cruises. This is a brand new yacht. So we have Emerald Waterways, which are the river ships, and then we have Emerald Yacht Cruises. So oh, I'm going to start with Emerald Waterways. Just once again, just briefly show you some of the awards. The main award here that you can see, since 2004 through 2019, Emerald has been awarded the best river cruise line for value. I think that says a lot. That's incredible because of all the different choices that people have, they're always looking for value and we get the award for best river cruise value every year. Shot of one of the Emerald ships. Why Emerald Waterways? We've got experienced cruise line directors. We've got the Emerald Plus program experiences. The difference between Scenic and Emerald is we only offer complimentary wine and beer uh, instead of total all-inclusive. We do have activity man managers. It is geared for a younger, more active crew because they do have an Emerald Active program on board with an activity director who takes the temperature of the clients and uh, we'll put together some some bike trips kayaking trips we have five-star dining on board very important all tips gratuities transfers port charges and taxes and wi-fi are included and you get of course you get the great uh, cruise views so where does emerald sail so this is a little smaller group number of ships than uh, scenic but the main uh, cruising is done from the rhine and the danube as you can see here we also have France cruises and uh, Portugal cruises. You can see the Duro. Just a sampling of what the ship looks like. Um, as you saw with Scenic River, it's about 160 guests. This is 180 guests. Um, and you can see the different decks. You got the Riviera, Vista, Horizon, and Sun deck on board. Just to gonna throw you through a couple of slides here to see you can get a flavor. It's a little more modern, um, Art Deco-ish. Uh, the Horizon Bar and Lounge. This is where the main activities and nightly entertainment takes place. You can see the bar in the background there. We have Reflections Restaurant, where the main dining area. The Terrace Restaurant, which has uh, food available most of the day. Wellness and Spa is also a focus on board this i want to spend a minute on this this is very unique to the emerald cruise line we have an indoor pool area as you can see with a retractable roof so the retractable roof is for when it's really nice out and if it's not so nice they can retract the roof and guests can still swim at night they push a button and the floor comes up and it turns into a cinema it's also a great area it has a little bar area in it it's a great area for groups and uh, when I just did my fam trip from Amsterdam on Emerald Waterways, we did the group briefing uh, and we had a little cocktail party for our travel agents in this area. We have one bedroom owner suites on board. Once again, we're famous for the sun lounges, which makes your room bigger. You can see it here on this slide. The majority of the, uh, the suites are grand balcony suites. And once again, you can see there the um, size of it and the, the window that goes up and down so you can keep it open or closed. The panorama balcony suites in the back of the ship. And then this is our standard uh, stateroom which is on the uh, lowest level of the ship. We have the Emerald Active Program. I talked a little bit earlier about that. Um, 
the bikes on board here are not e-bikes, so you have to pedal those. And the activity director will, as I said, really works with the guests to uh, give them the type of tours that they want. Emerald Plus, a, we do uh, take you behind the scenes. We have a little cocktail and, and cake with the Croatian family as an example. We have the Discover More program, which is basically the scenic and rich program where the guests on Emerald have the option to buy. Uh, for example, they can buy that Palace Lichtenstein concert on Thursday night in Vienna. So, um, and those, the cruise director can show you the options and the pricing is very reasonable for the Discover More program. Emerald Waterways uh, is in Southeast Asia as well with a brand new ship. This is the Emerald Harmony, which was built and launched last year. Very, very unique because it only draws three feet. Um, it has 84 guests, 42 cabins, 40 crew. And what's unique about it is one of the few cruise ships in the world that can dock in Ho Chi Minh City. It was specifically built to be able to do that. Just to show you a little inside look at the Emerald Harmony, the one bedroom of suites, the one bedroom terrace, grand balcony suites, and the panorama balcony suite. Horizon lounge area, Reflexions restaurant, the pool outside, and the Lotus Lounge on board the Emerald Harmony. Now I'm gonna switch gears and flip over to a brand new ship that will be launched in next year, the uh, Emerald Azura which is um, only holds 100 guests, very unique in size. Um, has an observation deck, sky bar, pool and cafe, terrace. I'm gonna show you, it goes to some very, very unique ports. Uh, we have Zodiacs on board, a wellness area, reflections restaurant, horizon bar and lounge, and of course, an observation deck. So we have, an, uh, here's an overview of the staterooms on board. This is the Ocean View stateroom. This is a view of the balcony stateroom. We have a terrace suites, as you can see, very beautiful uh, overview shot of what the terrace suite looks like. And of course the owner's suite. And a shot of an overview of the owner's suite. Inside we have the Horizon Bar and Lounge, Reflections Restaurant, Outside, we have the terrace. So can you imagine cruising in the Mediterranean and sitting here and having lunch at the pool cafe, uh, infinity pool. And this is my favorite area here, the sky deck and pool spa. So you can, I mean, can you imagine just hanging out here as you're cruising through the Mediterranean or even the Red Sea? Observation lounge on board. Jim. And I want to show you where we cruise. So I'm going to hit this here. So as you can see, we discover the Med from Athens to Venice. We've got Greece and Turkey with Istanbul. Discover Spain, France, and Italy. And of course, the ancient uh, world wonders. So it basically cruises the Mediterranean, Adriatic, uh, and the Red Sea. So very unique itineraries and very unique ports because of its size. Okay, groups and charters. I just want to finish up by talking about these for a second. Uh, we have a, the group basics are we have a minimum of five cabins uh, for 10 guests for a group. Tour conductor is one uh, free for nine on rivers and one free for 15 on the scenic eclipse because of the size of the ship. We offer group discounts, which range from $500 to $1,500, depending on the brand, itinerary or sailing date. And we have fly-free programs as well. The agent portal, uh, another tool for you, very important. Uh, we have Express Book, which is our booking engine for travel agents, and we do webinars on how to use it. We have the Scenic Rewards Program. I'll give you a little update on that in a second. The Agent Academy, it's your university to learn about our brand from river to ocean cruising. Uh, shows you our group offers in details. We have a travel advisor incentive. We have an events page which shows you tutorials, the product trainings that we can are updated here. So you can register to learn more about us. And if you happen to be a new agency, you just click on here and you can register yourself uh, with us. 
The next page is our a Agent Academy. We put a lot of work into this. I just want to say that you can earn CLIA certification credits. For each course you complete, you will earn three CLIA effective certification credits. Let me repeat that. You earn three credits for every one of these courses that you take. So they're great informative courses on, our, uh, on this platform covering both brands, and it's just a valuable tool for you to be able to use to learn more about our brands. Expressbook, um, and this is our reward programs. We started it in late 2018. We've received great feedback on this program. You don't need to sign up for the program. After making a booking, our system will generate a rewards ID for you and a welcome email to get you set up in your reward account. Um, and then an email will be sent the following month after your first booking. And when do you receive the reward points? You receive them after they sell, obviously. And then all the details here are listed. I'm not gonna get into them based on the time that we have, but there is a huge catalog for merchandise from gift cards you can receive uh, to merchandise. So toasters and um, Pro uh, iPhone Pro Max, things like that are available on board here for you to receive. I'm gonna finish up by just reviewing some of the current offers that we have out uh, for 2021. On the Europe side, we have flights included to Europe, um, the Diamond Deck bonus, uh, we have an early payment, payment discount of $350. We have a peace of mind program where you can put down 50% reduced deposits. Uh, for business class, uh, we have a fly for business class deal. And 50% off for the solo traveler on um, Scenic for departures 11 days or longer. On the Eclipse side, uh, once again, we get the peace of mind program, early bird special 10% off. Uh, we got a free round trip uh, economy airfare program if you book this. We also have say up to $3,000 worth of saving depending on the cruise you take. Uh, we offer business class air promotion, early payment discount, um, and some other things that you can see here on this slide. And then on Emerald Waterways, uh, same thing. We have free flights to Europe, reduced deposit. Uh, we've got some new short cruises. This is new for uh, 2021, which will be on the Danube five-day Christmas cruises. Seem to be in demand for that. We have a free extended drink package. Enjoy uh, on unlimited beer and wine on Splendors of Europe cruises and early payment program and Springtime's Delight cruises and new extended stays in Istanbul and Transylvania. So for today, by participating in this webinar, we have two show codes for you. If you book uh, now through uh, September 2nd, just use this code for Scenic on the left. It's pretty simple, ST for Scenic, show 09, and um, Emerald on the other side. For Scenic, you'll save $150 per person on top of all other offers, and $250 per person for the Scenic Eclipse, and $125 savings per person for yachts and uh, river. I would be remiss if I didn't show you our sales team. We're really proud. Our leader is Ian Chamberlain, uh, formerly of Virtuoso and Asta. And most of you know everybody on our sales team, especially this guy, Richard Hickey, who handles our national accounts. Uh, man, by far a cruise expert in our industry. Uh, that's me on the right. I've got the East Coast. Richard's got Florida and the National Accounts. We've got one of our superstars, o Oya, in the Midwest. And out West, our Western guy is Mark Jeanette. Once again, another guy uh, who's an expert in the cruise business. So this is our sales team with our contact information and our cell phones. So please don't hesitate to call us. Um, and that is kind of it for the actual presentation. So I am back for, um, I just wanna close out by saying two things. I wanted to tell you a little bit about where we are right now. So Scenic is currently canceled uh, all sailings through October 31st. Of course, we're monitoring that as the year goes on. 
But I, I think every all of you in the industry kind of get a sense of what's happening. We're managing our business day to day. The sales team I just showed you is very, very active with any travel agents who have bookings. We are spending a lot of time working with agents uh, on trying to not lose the booking, use the future cruise credit, because if you lose the booking, you lose your commission and we lose the business. So we've been very, very proactive in working with agents and we've been pretty successful at it. So um, we are investing in the future. <clears throat> I wanted to mention that we have three new ships coming on board. Uh, the Luna on the Riverside, the Azura, which I showed you, and we're building a brand new Eclipse 2. So um, Glenn, our owner, Glenn Maroney, owns a shipyard. So um, he's very up to speed on what's happening in the industry as far as new builds. And he has no plans to borrow funds. Uh, we're very financially secure. We own all of our ships. And I think that um, we're in a very, very good position uh, for the future. And um, it's good to be working for a company that is investing in the future by building three new ships. So that shows you the faith we have in the cruise industry moving forward. So with that being said, I will uh, open it up for questions and come back to you. Ian. Great, thank you. We do have some questions coming in. Our first one is from Dana, who is wondering if your ships are wheelchair accessible. We understand that getting on and off and maybe some of the destinations um, obviously are dependent on their own rules, but onboard facilities, can you speak to wheelchair accessibility? Not highly recommended. Um, on my fam trip, there was a, a customer that had a, a wheelchair and I, it was very difficult, especially when you get to the bigger cities like a Vienna or something like that, where ships are rafted together. Um, you have to go across two or three different ships to get to I just, I, I just think it's very, very difficult, and I just highly wouldn't, wouldn't recommend it. Okay, understood. Our next question is from Naki, who is wondering if um, you said that each suite has an independent circulation system, and is this true for all of your brands? From what I understand, I'd really, um, I want to be careful here, but because it was just mentioned on a conference call. But I do believe that all of the ships, when Glenn designed them, had their own independent air conditioning unit and air circulation unit, each suite. So um, I believe the answer to that is yes. And I hope I'm not wrong about that. Okay, fantastic. Dana is wondering if you offer any Swedish ports on itineraries. I'm sorry, I missed that question. Sorry, do you offer any Swedish ports on any of your itineraries? Hmm. I'll have to get back to her on that one. If you could give me her email, I'll have to get back to her on that one. Okay? Sure. Of course. And our next question. We've added some new stuff for 2021, so I'd have to really take a look at that. Of course. Our next question. Um, can you speak more about the Phoenix Culinary Program? Yeah, the, the Scenic Culinaire program is based on the uh, on the French cruises. Um, the chefs do private, um, uh, it's not tutorials, but <laughs> private sessions with guests where they um, actually show them how to cook. They let them cook. Uh, they pick out the ingredients. Uh, on the Eclipse, it's it's they have the whole there's a whole room for the culinaire program where they actually, not in the United States, but when they're traveling in other parts of the world, grow the herbs and vegetables right in that room and get them fresh for, uh, for the classes. Okay, fantastic. And we have some questions about agent rates. Do you offer agent rates? We do. We do offer agent rates. We also have a full, pretty full schedule of escorted FAM trips. So there's a difference between agent rates and uh, escorted FAMs. Each of us in sales escort a couple of FAMs a year. And I believe in 2021, once we start sailing again, we've been told that we're going to pretty invest in that pretty heavily because we want agents to get to see the product. Um, our normal... Um, They'll probably kill me for quoting rates here, but rough numbers are on FAMS for Emerald is 795. Uh, 
for everything, beer and wine included. And for Scenic, we charged $8.95 last year for FAM. So just to give you a rough idea of what those rates would be. Okay, fantastic. And we do have some questions um, about safety in the future. I know obviously a lot is unknown, but can you speak to any precautions that you know Scenic will be taking? So reduced capacity or masks or anything that you can speak to? I really can. I know the protocols are being developed now since we're not sailing through the end of 2021. All I have is the slide that I showed you in the PowerPoint. Um, I know that we, you know, I've, I've sailed twice last year, once on Emerald and once on Scenic. And there, before all this even happened, there were hand sanitizers right inside both doors when you board, um, you know, the individual air units. I just believe that we are a very, very safe ship. And one of the nice things is 160 people on these cruise ships. Uh, they're the same size as our, some of our competitors are putting 190, 200 on. So I, you know, I, I know that we are, we have a whole team in place. We're working with CLIA and government officials to make sure that we meet and exceed the health standards. Okay, wonderful. And I do just want to take this chance as a last reminder to everyone about the handouts available. So there's some collateral from Charlie available. And we have one more question coming in from Trina, who is wondering if flights and transfers are done pre-sailing to ensure that clients are there on the right day to sail. Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. And that wraps things up. Thank you, Charlie, so much for all of the wonderful information. And thank you, everyone, for joining us. Thank you all, and thank you for giving me your time. We really appreciate it. We hope to see you all on an exotic cruise somewhere on Scenic or Emerald very shortly. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye.